Hey guys, it's me, it's KC, and welcome back to the Kung Pao Major Event and Family Guy the Quest for Stuff. Let us do week three as it has finally popped up here. We got some dialogue with Mr. Miyagi, Dojo Peter. I cannot believe you have beat me. Well, I mean, it was kind of easy. You were on the phone the whole time trying to catch Pokemon. I am the only player left. All the best Pokemon just waiting for Miyagi-san. That's actually really true. Nobody even talks about Pokemon anymore. You know, the whole craze obviously with Pokemon Go, so... Alright. We got stuff in the corner, we've got a quest. We've also got some ads. I think maybe the quest is the first thing to do. John! Ooh. Got one of those, finally. I'm not having a lot of luck with those contracts. Brace yourselves, cause I have got big news! Yes! I beat Mr. Miyagi. That means I get to go to the finals. I'm surprised how one-sided the fight was. It kinda wasn't cool of you to just sit on him until he passed out. I believe the erection his unconsciousness body had would respectfully disagree. Senseis are here! Have jo Dojo Peter get a better belt. You know what? Yeah. Okay, let's just check out these new villains, I guess. Alrighty, so it says here that frustrated after not being able to advance in the tournament, senseis are in Kohog looking for a fight. So they're bullies, basically. Recruit stronger fighters to challenge the karate masters. We've got... I don't even know what the hell that's supposed to be. Oh, it's that... You know who it's supposed to be, actually? It's the, the street fighter dude who can, like, stretch or whatever. I, I don't remember his name. I really should. But I just don't remember off the top of my head. Then we also have Billy Blanks, who I recognize any day of the week. Defeat your opponent to earn stuff to trade for rice balls at the cart. So black belts are going to be the new currency for the rice balls. Yep. Previously, we obviously had the samurai headbands. And then the previous week before that, the first week, we had the white belts. So... Alrighty. Dojo Peter. Got 30 Am seconds. Right? You is got 30 seconds. We have fortune cookies. We've got those, uh, what are those things that you light? I can't remember, man. My everything. What the hell it is? There we go. In the meantime, let's see. Awesome! If you're gonna insult me again, Mom, just go Mom, there's away. a giant golden dragon. Yes, there is actually. The golden dragon popped up in the previous phase, and when you tapped it, it said, Oh, you, you can't do anything with them, not yet. Oh no, did we forget to fill your antipsychotic prescription again? You did, and I can finally feel feelings again, but there really is a dragon. Look! Golden dragon is here! If you're a time son of a gun, I am going to be so ticked off. I don't know if I should tap it yet. I'm gonna just, just, uh, just close that. Because, oh, hello. You're, you're there. Oh no, it's one day. It can't be a time character then. So I will tap it. Offerings are back. That's what the stuff was we saw a second ago with the fortune cookie and the thing that delights. What the heck is this thing supposed to be? I collect it. Gold! Oh, is that what that is? I thought it was a little sailor hat. Or like one of those like ships that you make. You know, the little paper... Never mind, damn it. But it's Quagmire Peter, Muddled Merc Tavern, and Kung Fu Zoo. So what exactly is the point of this? Like, is this to actually get the Golden Dragon? Peter, you're not gonna believe this, but fitness legend Billy Blanks wants to train you for the finals. He does? That's awesome! But why does he want to help me? Well, he owes me big. When we were kids, I stopped bullies from stuffing Twinkies down his throats. They used to call it filling in the blanks. It was terribly cruel, but I gotta hand it to those guys. None of my bullies were ever that clever. That is actually really clever in a horrible way. From now on, we're is that actually do a thing? I do. Probably. Dang it, you beat me, you dumb chicken. Kung Pao Giant Chicken. Yeah, 
But I'm the real loser now that Taco Bell has a taco shell made out of fried chicken. We all lose for that one. Wait a second, is that actually a thing? I know they have that one taco that has like the shell and it's made out of like a Dorito shell. And it's freaking amazing. Defeat one sensei, get black belts, trade in the black belts, for rice balls at the ramen cart. Alright. Well, let's see what is needed. Is it the same two characters that we just saw a second ago? Let's see. So, three health, 15 of that, okay. So we can use Samurai Quagmire, Yogi Fighter Brian, which is probably premium, and then Billy Blanks as well. One thing I don't like about this is that when we get certain characters from previous weeks, they're pretty much useless when battling like the current villain for the week. I don't like that. But next up, let's look in the inventory. Let's see what we've got. For sure we've got the Brian thing. Yep. Yogi Fighter Brian. What does this cost? It costs 270. Can someone tell me what Ohm means? Well, I can't. Golden Dragon. So it is a character. So that's what the blessings are for anyway. 75 of them. I need 75 more red envelopes. Okie dokie. Did I call them blessings? Well, whatever. Dragon Warrior Statue. Muddled Merc Tavern. Please don't be timed. Please don't be timed. And we go down the list. Oh, those revive potions. They're so expensive. And I really wish I could use them. Anime Octopus. So these are all the things you can get with the chopsticks. I don't even know how many freaking chopsticks I have. I have 600. Holy crap. Do I seriously have that much? Oh god. So these are obviously the different things, the different buildings and stuff that we will need to unlock in order to get Billy Blanks and all that sort of stuff. Alright. Peter, did you see the Golden Dragon? No, I didn't think I could. I thought Trump was going to stop that tape from coming out of all, at all costs. Funny stuff. This place is a nut house. Wow, a golden dragon. How could you like, how would you like to be in our parade? Does Kuok generally have a Chinese New Year parade? No, but it's either that or we're making the world's biggest omelet with your golden eggs. So take your pick. Kuok's number one export is exploiting its freakish community. Unlock the Golden Dragon. Alrighty, so we're gonna have to do that. I'd like to invite the Golden Dragon over for dinner. What do you think he eats? I don't know, goats? Uh, I think that's what dinosaurs eat. Yeah, dragons are dinosaurs. They learned to breathe fire to survive the Ice Age. Everyone knows that. That's actually kind of true in the way of the fact that when you think of a dragon, it's kind of like a dinosaur, don't you think? Kind of? Get one fortune cookie, get one incense, get one gold. Alright, so we're going to actually go to the dragon now because I want to look at all the different characters that can get the different the offerings and things of that nature. So let's see. Yeah, so Peter Quagmire and then a building. Peter Quagmire, there's a building and let me guess. Peter Quagmire building? Peter Quagmire building. Alright, alright. <laughs> It's pretty basic stuff, so you just send the characters, get to certain buildings, get the drops, hand them in, raise up the meter, and when the golden dragon reaches zero for the timer, he goes into hibernation, he will pop up again, when, I don't know, and then just rinse repeat till he get to 75 of the envelopes. That's it. Pretty basic stuff, so you will obviously have till the end of the event for this, there's no timer on it that I can see, so... That's good, you at least have a couple of weeks to get to 75 envelopes. But next up, we are going to actually go to this, right here. And this is a new thing, which is in the temple for the week. So this requires 10 of them, which I have. I've actually got 20 of the rice balls, which is fantastic. I'll put your way up there. Next up is the Robin cart. The black bags, of course, are obviously for this particular week, and... Of course, you get them from the, the Sentes. Two, six, and twelve. Okie dokie. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? Hold on a second. 
Here, here's what here's what here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. First of all, real men wear side swept bangs. Still working on Johnny Lawrence. It is a time character. I need three more of the loser awards. You get them from Clan the the Samurai. Lots of chest hair was waxed to pull off this low cut gi. And 12 of 18 of the Cobra Kaiji. We're gonna actually go over here though, because there are things that are ready. Things are ready, like this. Damn it. And that. Hooray. And is that it? Yeah, that's possibly it. We're actually gonna battle Samurai now, actually, because. I still have to get a couple more of the loser thingies. So, hold on a second. There, you. Actually, hold on. <laughs> okay, now we can do it. My watch don't tell time. <laughs> samurai, samurai. Where's the samurai, damn it? Where's the samurai? You know what? What's the easier way to do it? Let's do this. Samurai. Okay. These freaking contracts are so difficult to get. Ooh, Seamus can get it now. Yes, please, Seamus. All right, cool, cool. Yes, please, Seamus. As long as none of them miss, I'll be okay. Uh, reason being is that, you know, Doja Peter only has four of eight. So, if one of them miss, I'm dead. Here we go. Oh, my luck, I'm gonna miss. Come on, come on, hit on. Okay, good. Good, good. He didn't miss. Hooray! Boom. More of these thingies, which is awesome. Do, 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 do. So Johnny Lawrence isn't really needed for this next week, which is really, really frustrating. Honestly, I still want to try to get the character because I'm so close to kicking them anyway. I mean, I still have, you know, three and a half days basically to go. So I just need a few more things and I should be okay with that. So I'm just going to focus on getting a couple more samurais down and then I'll be able to take the characters and start battling for the senseis but uh, going back to the sensei really quickly if I can find one once again the characters are quagmire and then I have to try to get Billy blank so it's gonna it's gonna require some work to do unfortunately but I'll do the best that I can moving forward for that that was amazing thank God I got another contract you thank you secret. thank you but long story short there's Billy blanks there's a golden dragon and then of course there's the yogi Brian costume or whatever it was called premium wise if you want to go that route and you know, everything is still exactly the same you know the new I guess villain is a sensei black belts have now invaded as you can see here for the ramen cart and you take these particular items the rice balls when you get them exchange them for these as you saw earlier with me getting the the first building there then that's pretty much it follow the main quest line and you will be okay. So yeah, contracts. Those contracts are still pain in the butt. If we could get more of them, it would be so much more easier. And obviously the, the thing with the healing, that's a big pain in the butt as well. Those are the two biggest things. Contracts and the potions. Not being able to get the potions unless you spend a ton of clams. That's what's really frustrating. But other than that, it's a fun event. I'm enjoying it an awful lot. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this video as well. If you did, please remember to like, comment, and share. Thanks for watching. My name is Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, guys.